Old horse in Frisco may have saved his own life. His story now spreading online and earning him fans around the globe. Andrea Lucia is at Becky's Hope Horse Rescue in Frisco with Bubbles the Horse and his unusual story of survival. Yeah, volunteers here at Becky's Hope weren't actually planning on rescuing him. Uh, they were focused on several donkeys that were also set to be slaughtered, but that's when they say he got sneaky. Come on, Bubbles. You want your dinner? With his frostbitten ears and old joints. Where are you going? Bubbles isn't what most buyers look for in a horse. That may explain how he ended up at a lot headed for Mexico to be sold for slaughter. It breaks my heart every time I go. Sue Chapman was there with Larry McConaughey saving these miniature donkeys from the same fate. I look up and I see oh. this horse with little crumbled ears and he's weaving his way through all these gates. There were several employees that were <laughs> trying to push him back and he just, nope, wasn't having any of it. The women say he headed straight for their trailer. I firmly believe that he thought if he mixed in with the mini donkeys, we wouldn't notice. I mean, he was just like, I'm just one of them, and got on the trailer with them, stood there like, you don't see me, and kept his head kind of down. I said, Sue, <laughs> I just can't leave this guy. The two paid the lot $450 rather than return him. They shared the story on Facebook, where more than a million people have seen it. I've never had that happen. People from all over the world are sending $5 from Japan, $5 from Germany, you know, $15 from England the other day. Bubbles is now slowly gaining weight. Thank you. Looking happy in his new home. $5,000 in donations for Bubbles. Now that's more than they need for his care, so they say they've gone ahead and used some of it to rescue two other horses just like him. Reporting live in Frisco, Andrea Lucia, CBS 11 News.